we were delivering a, a, a convoy. We, we, we were in, in the area of the Needles in the Channel. And it was one of those days which was very cloudy at times. And it would, it would be early evening, late afternoon, early evening. And I was, I was up on deck. I, I wasn't on watch. I was up on deck and sort of watching what was going on. And we, we were alongside a, a Canadian ship that, that had got a, a load of ammunition, which we established subsequently. And suddenly the, the, this, this aircraft appeared out, out, out of the clouds and let go a torpedo. And as it happened, our watch outs on, on the bridge were were very much on the ball and they spotted it and because of the of, of their promptness the, we were able to alter course and of course by altering course it missed us which was the target and it hit this Canadian ammunition ship which fortunately despite sinking it didn't explode so heaven knows what damage would have happened if if it had hit another part of the ship, but we we took most of most of the ship's company of, of of the freighter, but there were four people left behind who 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 didn't manage to, to to escape. But we then spent time picking them all up and 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 you know making them comfortable, giving them food and, and fresh clothes. That, that, that was quite an experience. Another thing that you don't forget, you know, I can see it now. I was up on deck and I was looking round and there was this flipping great aircraft bearing down, down on us. Amazing. Not, and not thinking at the time, oh, oh you know, are we going to get it? 